Jericho, welcome back to my channel. Since I recently filmed the mid-year book freak out tag, I thought it would be a good idea to update you on my reading goals for the year and see if I want to make any changes to them. As you might remember, one of the first goals that I wanted to accomplish this year is to read Sarah Dessen's books. I definitely accomplished this goal since recently I read all of her books within the past couple of months or so. So I definitely accomplished this goal. And I can't wait until she writes something new. The next goal that I had was to read at least three YA bent fantasy trilogies or series, not including Rick Riordan. I haven't completed this goal yet. One of my focuses for the latter half of the year is going to be reading YA and adult fantasy as well as science fiction. So I'm definitely confident that I could complete this goal by the end of the year for sure. My next goal was to try to read urban fantasy, and I'm not sure that I... I'm going to accomplish this goal this year since it's not necessarily something that I'm interested in at the moment. So I might read some urban fantasy next year. My next goal that I wanted to complete this year was to get back into reading more YA paranormal fantasy since this is a genre that I haven't read constantly in years. This is a genre that I read before I started my booktube channel. So it's been a while since I've read YA paranormal fantasy on a regular basis. I might choose to get back into reading YA Paranormal Fantasy in October, closer to Halloween, or I might not. I just have to see where my mood lies. I might also want to read some thrillers during October, but again, I'm not sure if I'll be in the mood for this. During the second half of the year, I know that I mostly want to focus on reading YA and adult science fiction and fantasy books. That's what I'm mostly going to focus on, but we'll see what my mood is. I recently made some videos about the YA and adult science fiction and fantasy that I want to read, so I'll link those videos in the description below if you're interested in checking those out. I also made a series that I want to read in 2018 video. I have read some of those books from that video. I still want to get hit to some of those dystopian and post-apocalyptic books. If you want to get technical, dystopian and post-apocalyptic books do fall into the science fiction category, but I tend to separate the whose books since they are similar, but they are different in other ways as well. So I might pick up some dystopian books from that series video, or I might not. My last goal for the year was to read some YA contemporary books. I did make a video about all the YA contemporary books that I want to read this year, and I'm still interested in reading those. A couple of the books that I'm definitely going to get to who from that list is My Life Next Door by Huntley Fitzpatrick and the Did I Mention I Love You trilogy by Estelle Maskane. Other than that, I'm probably just going to randomly choose the YA contemporary books I want to read this year. In general, reading YA contemporary this year is still one of my goals. Those are all of the updates that I have for my 2018 reading goals. Let me know in the comments if you're on track with your reading goals, or if you have to change some of your reading goals now that it's halfway through the year. Some of the goals stayed the same, but I made some minor tweaks to other goals. If you want to see more videos from me, I'll put some videos up on the screen in case you guys want to check those out. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you want to continue watching my videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in my next one.